What's up, folks? As you can see, I'm rocking my Wyoming Ice Hole Gator here. Um, I'll have a, if you're interested in these, I have a link down in the description below that you can check out. But, um, yeah, so came out today, got the hut all set up. I'm going to make a fishing video. The Nothing. I mean, nothing. I've been out here for two hours and not even a line has jiggled. So um, then a fun thing happened. I was kind of lazy this morning. I uh, failed to, sorry, let me get this glare off my glasses. I failed to, uh, to tie down my front of my hub and uh, I've got water heating up on the heater for some hot chocolate and a uh, big gust of wind came and of course any of you who's ever um, experienced that knows what happened. Heater went flying, cup of water went flying all over me. Um, the interesting thing, my lucky sonar fish finder went flying because I keep it in this little pouch right there. It went flying um, directly into the hole. Thankfully, I caught it um, because this sonar has a float on the end of the transducer. So I was able to pull it back. It went down four feet or so, and it hit really hard. It smacked. I saw it smack on the ice before it came down, and then it got sucked into the hole. Anyway, pulled it up, um, and uh, I'm just going to do a video on the effects of that. So, yeah, this is a little fishing excursion has turned into a, another a third lucky fish finder video what happens when bad things happen so anyway stay tuned i'll let you know right row folks my uh sidewall of my tent popped in went everything went fleeing my heater everything fling off because i didn't tie it down this fell in the hole i managed to grab the cord but look there be water inside so, as you can see, it's still working, and there is, that's not a crack, that is water sloshing around in there. Um, yeah, let's see what happens. Ten minutes later, folks, the water is drained out, mostly other than just that little corner there. Um, where it's gone, I'm not completely sure. But she's still working. So my major concern is this, thus far. This, I've had steady um, fish at the bottom. I'm in four feet here. I've had steady fish at the bottom this whole time. Um, that has completely stopped. Now it is possible that the fish have moved on and are not hanging around anymore. God knows they're not biting. Maybe they are all laying down there asleep. Well, see, here comes what looks like a little pass through. So I was gonna say my concern is I've only seen marks at about a foot and a half um, up to this point, and, and since I, it went in the drink, I haven't seen anything below that. But there it was, uh, caught it on tape. That was the first one that I saw go uh, go through like that. So yeah, well I don't know. Stay tuned. We'll keep seeing how she works. All the water's gone out of the screen now. You can see there's residue inside, but. I may not ever be able to do anything about that. But yeah, she's working. It is now 30 minutes post drop. I haven't turned it off or dried it out or anything. All right, folks, hour and a half after sinking it. Still working. I, uh, I'm not sure how, not sure why. Granted, there's no fish underneath me right now to prove it, but it is working. One just passed through a second ago. That's what reminded me to film. Yeah, still trucking. Doesn't look like there's going to be any permanent effects. Alright. Alright, two and a half hours post drop in the water. This thing has been very silent. Um, I believe that it is because there are no fish here. And I'll tell you why. I think that is because this sure it hasn't set off like there's been any fish come under but it's still reading a depth um, let's see if i can get into where you can see it's still reading a depth it's still reading the same depth that it, i know this is um yeah so still working which is great 
Um, anyway, we're right at two and a half hours in. I think she's gonna be okay. Four and a half hours in, she's still working. I think it's gonna survive. All the lines are working, showing fish coming through. Still, by the way, have not caught a fish. Haven't even got a good solid bite. But that's fishing. Anyway, I believe this thing is good. It uh, officially passed the uh, drop in an ice hole test for sure. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching. I'll let you know if anything changes.